And well, it's me, Jared Paulson, speaking to you once again. And for tonight's video, video game, and I mean, tonight's action figure review is going to be on NECA Robocop Ultimate Robocop. Take a look at the figure itself. Now, I know Robocop ever since school. You may know who he is, but I'm not going to fully explain who he is fully. If you have seen if you have seen my previous video about Robocop, please look at that please look at the previous video. I'm doing this review for Robocop because there's a new Robocop game coming out next month called Robocop Rogue City. This takes place between the events of Robocop 2 and 3. And this is and that's the game I'm going to get for my birthday this year. So yeah. You may know who Robocop is, but I'll explain fully if you haven't known it at all. He is a cyborg police officer who is formerly policeman Alex Murphy who gets killed by Karen Spodaker and his gang in the first film. Alex Murphy is dead, but Robocop, however, was born. Here's the accessories for Officer Murphy. He has his data spike hand, which was used in the first film. You hack in computers, do video recordings, etc. Blast effect for his Auto 9, which we'll get to in a minute. Unmasked Robocop, which is the hand like this of Peter Weller, who portrays Robocop in the first and second film. It's the interchangeable head right here. His Cobra Assault Cannon, which is used from Clarence and his gang and used to take down the ED-209 to get into the police, to get inside OCP. And he also has his Auto-9, his main primary weapon, which can be stored in his holster right here. With the enlisted instructions, which is installed, enlisted right here. Lastly, articulation. He has head, shoulder, forearm, upper ab, leg, knee, feet, and no articulation. Oh well. The next two figures I'll be doing are procurement. I probably, I probably might do Ed 209, but I don't think so. I might do the battle damage first of Robocop soon. So, just be sure to see that, okay? But anyway, this is Jared Paulson signing off, and we'll be the law.